Well, we just got back from church. Are you still coming over? Oh, hell yeah, I am. Sunday brunch is my shit, sweetie. Are you sure you're ready for this? Yeah. I love to meet your parents. It's gonna be great. Okay. See you soon. All right, sugar buns. We'll be there in a bit. You got any clean underwear on you? Hey there, I'm Sarah Jean Underwood, and I'm here with a little lesson on what not to do when you meet a girl's parents. She may be wild at the bar and naughty in the sack, but in daddy's house, she's a good girl. So here are some quick tips for making sure you handle things right when you meet her parents. Hello. Yeah. Oh my God, no pants. Love those legs. Speaking of loving legs, hi mama. Wow, I see where she gets them from. Oh my God. Don't treat her mom like one of her girlfriends. Your job is to be charming, but excessive flirting is tacky. Stick to a respectful handshake and polite conversation. This is not the time to try and be cute. Is that dad back there? Hey, you mind if I call you dad? Uh, I prefer Richard. All right, Dick. What's for brunch? So, tell us about yourself, William. Oh, uh, well, I uh, was sold to the circus as a young child after I uh, accidentally killed my parents. <laughs> Left the gas on. I didn't know, you know, that it smelled like anything. And uh, I come from a long line of polygamists, which I'm looking to get back into popularity, you know. <laughs> hey, you feisty, she's all over me. Keep your hands to yourself. This is her parents' house, and you need to keep things G-rated. For the duration of the visit, you need to think of her as your great aunt Mildred. Save all the touchy-feely for some other time. I got a good one for you. What's the difference between Sarah Palin's mouth and her vagina? Lipstick. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'll go check on the quiche. Uh, don't forget your lipstick. Don't bring up controversial topics. You don't want to alienate her parents before you even get to know them. Keep the conversation light, focus on safe topics and stuff that'll help you guys get to know each other. The weather, your work, and general questions about their family are all great. Brunch is ready. <laughs> I'm starving. William, would you like to see Grace? Uh. I'm not really religious. Oh my God. It tastes like foot. Don't complain about the food. Eat what you can and pretend that it's good. Compliment the cooking and remember this is her mom's table. So act like your mom raised you right. So, Will, what exactly is your line of work? Well, not much since last Wednesday I got my ass fired. So, just working on your daughter. Before that, I uh, was big into making copies. Just copying whatever. My foot, my butt, you know, mm. my penis. <laughs> Gave her a copy of that. Don't undersell your career. The main way to show them that you're a serious guy is by talking about what you do and where you're going. If you're in telemarketing, tell them you're in sales. If you're waiting tables, emphasize that you understand hard work means more tips. They'll understand that you're starting out, but you have to sell it the right way. Well, I would love to stay and rock some categories, but uh, Sarah and I need to hit the beach. There's a wet t-shirt contest I do not want to miss. No, Will, I, I think it's time for you to go. Sarah's going to stay here. Okay, Dick. I guess Sarah's gonna do go. a little family time without me. That's great. Um, Don't touch uh, the walls, just go. All right, you have a really great house. All right, Sarah, I'll get you. So that's a perfect example of what not to do when meeting a girl's parents. Be respectful, don't make inappropriate jokes, and no fondling. I'm Sarah Jean Underwood. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check back soon for more lessons from Playmate Show and Tell at playmate.spike.com. What do you call a uh, lesbian dinosaur? Likes to lick a lot. Jesus, <laughs> I screwed that one up. Because <laughs> I don't exercise except in the bedroom.
<laughs> oh, 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 you know what I mean? Because <laughs> she's got what it takes. A uh, vagina, actually. <laughs> I also sell my body hair. You make pupes, whatever those. Pubic wigs. 